this is electric kangoo ZA uh, 2016 one of the, my favorite uh, models for commercial use uh, but with bad battery pack this one has 100,000 kilometers and we will make new battery pack like we did with for electric smart 451 this is our customer from Zagreb and this is first prototype which will be made here in EV clinic and which we will deploy for other customers because this is one of the most desired model for town delivery or mid-town delivery or anything else this is the battery pack It's a little bit bigger than electric smart battery. This is the part number. Oh, uh, you can smell the odor of electrolyte. Uh, cells are probably leaking and you can see the modules inside which looks the same like Nissan Leaf. Uh, they, those cells are one of the worst qualities. Uh, they degrade, degrade very fast and it's not replaceable. Now we will analyze high voltage wiring, low voltage wiring and try to replace all the cells with the new system. So we need, will need to design the new system on old wiring to see where is the uh, cell number one, two, three, four, and till 96. So we will be need we will need to sketch everything, uh, design everything, and we will go step by step by marking the wiring and my, marking all the uh, sense wiring to see where we can place the modules and how to get out uh, with the wiring. All pack is out. You can see the, how it's connected from the high voltage side. This is the uh, service fuse on this side. Other side is high voltage output. It is two BMS. ECUs and this is how it looks like when it's empty and we will now plan how to put the modules we need to put eight of them inside to get 18 kilowatt hour of capacity so we now <laughs> we are testing how, how many modules we can fit inside uh, this is uh, 12 s 1p module same which we used on electric smart and we can see we can fit eight of them which is perfect to get 400 volts and 18 kilowatt of kilowatt hours of capacity but we tested now if we can fit double that size to get 36 kilowatt pack from the same uh, uh, amount of space inside so uh, this is almost perfect to, uh, to make two uh, different packs one with 18 kilowatt and uh, second one with uh, 36 kilowatt hour of capacity. We will make only 18 kilowatt in the first step to see uh, uh, how we will make the wirings and everything else. So in the beta testing, this is how it will look like. We will make uh, aluminum hinges holders to fit everything perfectly inside. So, it, so nothing moves uh, when we are when, when you are driving the car. 
In the first step, we are designing the bottom frame which will hold all eight models on both sides. So we are trying to find the simplest way possible uh, where, we'll, where we'll weld the bridges here on the side, make the holes, uh, make four frames and fit everything together so we can test if it, if it holds perfectly, then we will proceed with the DNS. the first side how it should look like with the frame with the bolts sure holding stiff and I think this is almost finished all bolts holes yeah everything is done and this is the one of the most painstaking tasks to identify all the water sense wiring to mark everything with the numbers and to organize with the new connectors because we will use original wiring which was used on the Ford hybrid. So we will not change the sleeve boards on the modules. We will use original wiring which will be connected to the original uh, wiring of the Renault because we will use original connectors, original BMS and everything else. Low voltage wiring, high voltage wiring and sense wiring is almost complete. We use original Ford connectors connected to the old Renault Z uh, battery wiring. Uh, next step is to organize where we will put safely low voltage and sense wiring. So we, are, we, we designed and we are printing now uh, plastic uh, channels where we, will, where we will put all the wires inside. This is the last stage. Uh, we need to fix all the wirings and we can go for with the first test. We tested all the cells and we found something around four or five all, uh, high uh, resistance cells. So even even, even with the with the defect battery pack, we still have some of the of the spec cells in good condition which will be reused again and this I must say this is this looks perfect it's everything tight uh, we will print uh, on the high voltage uh, bolts we will print the caps so even that will be protected we are using original wiring for the service fuse and uh, we will print holder of the BMS here and there so everything will be tight and secured. So to secure low water wiring and voltage sense wiring from the high voltage we made a plastic PVC holder to secure it in the middle and we designed holders for the BMS so we, we will fix it here on the model and what is the most important thing is the weight of the module. Total weight reduction is, is astonishing. It's almost 100 kilograms. All the battery pack only for the cell modules is uh, 100, uh, 202 kilograms. And this one, we made measurement, it's 101 kilograms just for one module. And battery pack is two of them. So this is 100 kilograms of weight reduction. Uh, this should be this only this should increase the range of the of the vehicle even with the lower capacity battery pack. While while guys are assembling the battery pack for the first test, we need to make the backup of the BMS because we have one secondary issue. When original BMS detects that uh, state of health of original cells is below 50%. Uh, BMS locks into limp mode. That means uh, it will allow only 30% of total power from the battery pack. So to prevent overheating or, or any other issues, we will need to read. This is a Renaissance chip, and there is a small EEPROM here. We will we will need to read it to make the backup and to find 
uh, where is uh, alert flag, which we will remove it directly from the memory. So we will be able to have original 100 state of health until BMS calculates new state. Okay, we successfully read out the memory and uh, it will be pretty tricky to find where is the location or the state of health. Battery is inside the car. We need to confirm first that it works. Then we will recharge, reset and check if we have other codes. Now, it's always important to test do we have a ready state and does the wheel spin. Yeah, we have spinning. Now we will assemble everything. We will recharge the battery pack to full. Let's see the first test road. Battery pack is uh, almost 105 kilograms less weight. This should automatically give more range, and uh, yeah, we, should, we hope that the customer will be very happy. So I will mention one more topic after we finish the test road. I must say I'm really impressed with this car and I really love it because uh, there is no better substitution for this one for commercial use uh, but you can hear on the right side of the window he has issue with the Q210 drive in it uh, I will probably need to inform the customer that he has issue with the rotor bearings and gearbox bearings We'll, we will need to remanufacture the electric motor too but uh, second thing what I want to mention what I didn't know and I, you probably didn't do that this is French made car and I didn't know that French government doesn't allow this type of sustainable battery recycling and battery remanufacturing so to pro prolong the life of those type of the cars for commercial use or any type of use uh, French government is f is fully pro prohibiting the repair of the battery pack touching of the battery pack changing cells or doing anything what is not original by the manufacturer even if you use original uh, manufactured modules, bricks, cells, it doesn't matter from other cars uh, you can repair the battery pack only if you use same cell that means they, in the, they are prohibiting any type of possible uh, reusing of old electric vehicles on the road and this is completely stupid and uh, any workshop in the France cannot give any sustainable way of repurposing those really good and really quality cars so I will make one more video to test the range and that's it guys